pick it up in the near corner. He's pressured by Melanson, gives it away. Miller centering pass, looking for Nanny. Comes all the way through, kept in by uh, Reno on the far side half boards. Nanny's tied up over there now. Trying to work it out to the corner. And he hands it off to Miller into the middle of the ice. A shot coming. He scores! <laughs> One nothing, engineers. A dream start for our. Moore in the corner. He's pinched off the play. Picked up Snidely. Trying to play it back to the point. Penalty coming here. As working it inside. A shot coming. They score. It's a tie game. And Yale's going to go on the power play. I believe that's Ryan Hitchcock who picked up the goal. Blue liner to break it up. And now another man cutting his nanny wide open. Far post. Can they find him? Borbonet walking right in. And he elected to carry into the middle of the ice. And he couldn't get a shot away. Near point. Reno. Some space. A shot. He scores. <laughs> Have a two-to-one lead. The far side now pulled out of there by Wilson. He'll go behind the goal with it. Near side for Dechara. Minute to go in the Yale power play. Wilson driving the net, working his way down though, turning and shooting. Save and they score. It's stuck through. It's going to be Goss on the rebound, and it's 2-2. Two -two. Larkin, a shot it. through. Traffic goes wide. Near side circle to Obakowski. He overskates. Good play by Wood to break it up. Diving play by Reno out to center. Liljegren on the move. Victor Liljegren moving in. He takes a shot. He scores. That did not end the way I thought it was going to end. Given the way things were going in overtime, it was a lot of Yale Bulldogs. It was a, it was just a tremendous amount of pressure. Cam Hackett bent, but he did not break.